And we got one bagpipe in tune! Huzzah! Yeah. Hey, I was more excited. It's not that hard, but it's still pretty exciting. We got one bagpipe in tune! Huzzah! And up for the second one. and a lot of tunes, but we don't get a lot of victories. So here's one from it. It's the actual marching tune of Fiach McHugh O'Byrne. Fiach McHugh O'Byrne. The royal name. He was the king of Ireland. Have you ever seen Irish names? They're terribly difficult to speak. Siobhan, spelled S-I-O-B-H-A-N. So here's an old tune, the marching song of old Fiach.
watching you dance like, and jump is fantastic. You know what I think they deserve? A sip! A sip is oh. I, I got this. I got this. Oh, you have a backup. I can't do it. Because when you're high in dry country, you bring extra water when you're singing Irish to it. So we're going to teach you one word of Irish. One word of Irish, David. One word that means help or cheers. Slonja! Slonja! And we sing. Well, after that... Were you both dancing on your thirst level? Well, after that rousing war tune, let me share with you something a little bit more personal. This is the tune I've been singing since I was four years old. You know, in your country, I hear you sing something along the lines of Twinkle, Twinkle, Little Star. Well, in Ireland, I learned a song about an old lady, a three-month-old baby, and a knight. Oh, what could possibly come wrong? It's Irish, and a children's song. Every. That really means that either somebody dies or somebody leaves. Or both. Exactly. So this is an old children's tune from me to you, from my childhood to you, called Wheela Wheela Walia.
Would you like to hear some more music? Say aye! Aye! Great, because we would love to continue to play for you. Why don't we play for you a tune on these old medieval bagpipes? These are the type of pipes that you really would have heard in Ireland in the 16th century. A little different from their Scottish counterparts from a couple of hundred years later. This is a tune out of the Breton region of the Celtic world. It's one called Hunter Row. There's a part in it for you about halfway through. So here, you're getting safer. <laughs> because it's a part that we all get to sing together. Will you do that with me? Say aye! Aye! You've got to remember, the Irish have been passing on our tales and history for a millennia through song. So in that emotional meaning, here's a tale about moonshine. Yeah, it doesn't. It's, it's a tale called The Moonshiner, and the third line of it goes like this. I'm going to say, and if you don't like me, I'm going to ask you to scream all that. Then leave me alone! Can you do that? Say aye! Aye! Then if you don't like me, then... Leave me alone! Yeah. But please don't leave us alone. Then we'll be up here playing with ourselves. We'll be really up. For ourselves. Prepositions oh. are important. That's true. Yes. Let's give that a try, shall we? Moving right along. I'm a rambler, I'm a gander, I'm a long ways from home. And if you don't like me, then leave me alone! Yeah. That, was, that was fantastic. Yeah. Alright, where's the moonshine then? I mean, that <laughs> felt courageous. Yeah. <laughs> Here we go, the two called the moonshiner.
Yeah. 